Hey, what is up guys? Sanzo here today and I'll be showing you how to make rice with the Black & Decker rice cooker. If you haven't already, check out my other video of the unboxing of how to make it and I hope you enjoy. So first things first, what you want to go ahead and do is add your salt. After you've added your rice, just add a little bit of salt so it adds a little bit of more flavor to your rice. But you don't have to add the salt if you don't want to but it's just something I would recommend that you would do. So that's what you're gonna do first. Okay, so next what you wanna go ahead and do is you're gonna wanna go ahead and add your water. So the rice ratio would be two to one, so you're gonna add like two, two cups of water for every one cup of rice that you do. So if you do like two cups of rice you're gonna want to go ahead and add four cups of water basically that's basically how it's gonna work but we added a little more water just to make the rice a little bit fluffier now don't add too much rice because when you mess up the ratio that means the water is going to boil over and that's what you don't want in your rice so I would say make sure you just put the perfect rice ratio so two to one so we added about three cups of the water just because we want the rice a little bit fluffy so next what you're gonna go ahead and do is you're gonna put go ahead and turn on your black and decker rice maker as well as if you want to add the steamer as I did as you see here I would say add that in now and then after that you start it up so to turn it on it's really easy as you see me plugging it in now it's not going to be hard to turn this on all you do is you're going to want to go ahead and press that lever and then you'll see a light that goes to cook so it's been about 30 minutes now and um, you can hear the actual cooking going on so i'll go ahead and let you listen So as you hear, it kind of fogged up my camera a little bit, so I had to fix that. But it is cooking right now, and it, for brown rice, that's what we were cooking. It takes around a good hour to 45 minutes, and the rice cooker already knows how long it takes. It knows the temperature of what's going on. Now for white rice, it'll probably be just about an hour, and that's just natural rice. So that's how long it takes but that was about it so it just finished cooking and now as you see the little orange light that means it's done um, so if you're wondering what this brown stuff is around that would be the starch that just came from like the outer rim and it kind of came out but don't worry about that you can wash that off it doesn't stink or anything it's just basically the starch from the rice from it cooking and the boiling that's all that is but um as you see here this is the finished rice um it is steaming hot right now as i said it just finished but um this is basically what it looks like and um that's basically it once again as you saw little brown film that's basically what that is all that is just the starch but the rice turned out great so what you're going to want to go ahead and do with that stir that came in the box like i said before make sure you check out the other video but you're just going to go ahead and stir that around and uh that's basically it so uh i'll show you a finished product and a meal of what i made that i added with it okay so this is the finished product of what we made so it basically was just brown rice carrots some uh, potatoes and some green beans a nice little hearty meal but this was the finished product i hope you guys did enjoy the video and if you did enjoy, give it a thumbs up if you liked the video and don't forget to comment in the description below and tell me if you liked this video or you didn't like the video and also follow me on instagram at angelo.savage and everything that i talked about in the video will be in the link description below and once again i hope you guys enjoyed the video and stay tuned for more thanks for watching peace